Amen. We thank You, Lord, for Your Word, Your life, Your strength, Your power. In Jesus' name, Amen. And we've been talking a series on who determines when you die. Who determines when you die? It's not God. It's you. And I'll give you a scripture for it. I'll give you a lot of scriptures in the last few videos. You'll watch all of them. But this one here is how to live, how to live long, which is not when you determine when you die. How to live long, how to live strong, how to live well. It's not God's will you don't live well, and it's not God's will you don't live strong, and it's not God's will that you don't live long. So this thing that people say, well, you know, some people are supposed to die young and some of them are supposed to die old. That's not true. Because it's God's will that all of us live long, live strong, and live well. And you can get that right out of Ephesians 6, chapter, verse 2. It says, Honor your father and your mother... Uh, which is the first commandment, which is the only commandment with the promise. Okay, so verse 3 says, in Ephesians 6, it says that things will go well with you and you will live long. One guy said, you'll live short upon the earth. No, you'll live long upon the earth. And then the next one is Matthew 15, 6. It says, honor your father and your mother and you're free. You want to be free today? You want to be free from trouble, free from anxiety, free from worry, free from sickness? Then do this. Honor God first. And then through that honoring of God, then you can honor your mother and your father because if you don't have that one first one down and you love them with the love of God, you'll give up, get mad at them, get in a fuss fight or something. And so, Because you can't do it. You can't love anybody without the love without honoring God first. So when you honor God first, what happens is the power, the strength, the anointing, everything is going to start flowing in your direction and the blessing comes with it. Have a good one.